sky or winter chill If I gotta take a break I will But I'm gonna run right up this hill It's khaki. This is my second take on this video, the wonders of technology. For some reason, my computer shut down in the middle of, of making it. So um, I am two weeks this past Monday from an extended tummy tuck and an extended arm lift. Just wanted to kind of tell you how things were going. I am back to work. I went back to work on Monday. Overall, I think things are going really well. I have not had any pain, just discomfort from the continued swelling. Uh, it is definitely different wearing these compression garments and I have on an abdominal binder. I think that that actually does make you feel a little bit better when I take them off to shower and I put them back on. It feels good to get them back on. I think, you know, just kind of like a snug bandage uh, can make a wound feel better. I am, I do still have a drain. Uh, I'm still putting out quite a bit. It seems to be going down, but it's still, it's definitely still there. Uh, Sunday, the day before I went back to work, I had my first day out. I went to, a, to see Beetlejuice at Tennessee Performing Arts Center in Nashville and had dinner afterwards with a friend that I work with. Had no problems. We did have to walk a little ways. I did get kind of tired, but other than that, no problems. One thing that I did notice when I sat down in the theater, tried to cross my legs and I couldn't due to the swelling. I was so proud after not being able to cross my legs for years of being able to cross my legs. That kind of, it's kind of alarming. You know, it feels like a little setback even though I know that it's temporary. I did find a really good support group on Facebook that I would recommend if you are thinking about plastics. It's called Plastics After Weight Loss Surgery. A lot of people share their experiences and give feedback. I posted in there about the amount of swelling that I'm having and got a lot of feedback on people with very similar and even worse experiences. And even though my surgeon has reassured me this is normal and transient, and from a medical standpoint, I know that, but hearing other people's experience really does reassure you. So my plan is just to stay off the scale for a couple of months until my body does what my body is going to do, which is heal and get rid of this fluid as the lymphatic system heals. I have a follow-up with my doctor on Friday, so I will see what he says. You know, going to discuss the swelling, make sure he still feels like we're okay. Going to talk about this darn drain. I think that it wouldn't surprise me if it doesn't stay in a little bit longer. I am anxious to change over from a abdominal binder to like Spanx or some kind of pull-on compression garment but I've tried it with the drain in and it just irritates that drain side. So I think I'm gonna to have to wait on that until this drain is out. As I said, I did come back to work on Monday. Sunday night, the first time I actually laid fairly flat to sleep. And when I got up Monday morning, I thought I had turned a corner. I felt like my abdomen was less swollen. I felt my legs, like my leg swelling was not as bad. Then I got up and went to work. And I had, I think it, Mondays are 10 or 11 hour days for me. By the time I got home, I was so swollen. It was, it was terrible. And it was painful from the, the pressure from the fluid. So, you know, I think in the mornings when I get up, the swelling is better. By the end of the day, it is, it is worse. It is what it is. I think that from hearing other people's experiences, that's kind of the way it goes. One tip I would have, if you are planning on having plastics after weight loss, hold on to a couple of your larger outfits um, I cannot fit in pants, and I cannot fit in the dresses that I was wearing right before surgery. 
So I dug to the very back of my closet some clothes that I was about to get rid of that were too a little bit too big, and that's what I'm wearing. I told the girls in my office, you're going to see the same, th the same three dresses on a rotation probably for several weeks, so just get used to it. I had also some knee boots I had bought. The, they were the wide leg like I wore before surgery, and I had bought the regular size, and I was so proud of them. Even they were a little bit, a little bit loose. I had to dig out the wide leg ones, and they are tight. So just if, if it, plastics are something you're considering, hang on to some of those clothes. I know it feels good to get rid of them and move on to something new and more size appropriate, but keep that in the back of your mind. You sure don't want to go buy clothes that you're only going to wear for a short period of time. Well, guys, I would love to hear where you're at. I would love to hear any struggles that you're having, any video ideas that you're having or that you have for me. I want to put out content that's helpful to you. I hope everybody has a great week, and I will update you next week on how things are going. Have a great week, everybody. Bye.